What's up, my fellow YouTubers? This is Ricky J, man. Welcome to another video. And people, can you tell I'm pretty jacked up, man? Because what we're going to do here is we're going to be reliving the epic matchup from Mike Tyson's punch out for the Nintendo Entertainment System. What is it, 34 years later? The game came out in September 1987, I believe. And what we're going to do here is we're going to set this matchup up in Fight Night Champion using Little Mac and see if we could beat. Big Bad Iron Mike Tyson. And as you see on the screen, I set Little Mac to an 80 overall, and I juiced up Mike Tyson's stats to a 98, just because I wanted to, you know, really showcase the um, the difference in skill, power, all that from the Nintendo game into this game, if that makes any sense. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna use Little Mac on the hardest setting and try to beat Iron Mike Tyson. <laughs> this is gonna be crazy. This is probably the biggest fight on my YouTube channel, I'm not gonna lie, man, I'm not gonna lie. So let's set this up. We're gonna set it. Let's make sure the settings are greatest of all time. Oh yeah, baby, we can't set it to anything less. 12 rounds, three minutes around. We're gonna set the settings to default, and it's gotta be at Cowboy Stadium, brother. It's gotta be at Cowboy Stadium because this is one of the biggest matchups ever. And um, like I said, man, we're reliving the Nintendo final fight between Tyson and Little Mac. And while it's loading, man, story time, baby. I got a story for you guys. You know, back in the day, I used to go to my good buddy Paulo's house, and um, he was a Portuguese good friend of mine, and he lived in a basement apartment with his uh, single mom and his hot sister, Sandra. And uh, on a side note about the sister, um, I had such a crush on her, man, and his mom would always um, teach me words in Portuguese, and she would say, next time, Ricky, that you see Sandra, say this. And I would tell her, Tu és muito bonita e eu gosto muito de ti, querida. Shout out to all you Brazilian Portuguese guys out there. And she would always get ready to go to the clubs, man, because she was, what, 11 years older than Paulo. And um, every time she would leave to the club, I would tell her, Taminha se Deus quiser, querida. And she used to think I was pretty weird, man, but... Come on, I had, I had the uh, <laughs> I had the big crush on her. I had the heart, or had the hots for her, even though I was so young, but... Um, Anyway, what was I getting at? Oh yeah, back to the story, man. I'm getting a little off track, but Paulo and I, um, I used to go sleep over at his house um, all the time, man. I would sleep over, you know, Friday night, Saturday night, and um, stay over until Sunday night. And we would just play Mike Tyson's punch out, man. We would always get to the end. We'd always get to Iron Mike, but we would always get outclassed by Iron Mike. We, I'll be honest with you, we couldn't dodge the crazy uppercuts that Tyson would throw his way or throw our way in the game. And um, the reason we were trying to beat him was obviously for pride, but also because we used to collect the, the Nintendo Power magazine. It was an old magazine, and they had a section in the magazine where it said if you could beat Mike Tyson, Mike Tyson's punch out, and take a picture of Mac with his hands up and uh, Super Mario saying victory or whatever, KO or TKO, um, they would send you a free game. So we were trying so hard, man. We would stay up late. And we were young kids, man. We would stay up so late. Um, it was nuts, man. So shout outs to my uh, good old buddy, Paulo. And I apologize for um, having mad love for your sister, brother. So, um, you know, come on. It's all good, brother. Let's, let's, uh, what do they say? It um, Dirt under the rug, water under the bridge. But anyway, let's see if we can finally, 34 years later, get a victory against Mike Tyson. And it's 98 versus 80. And I'm going to be honest with you, this is going to be hard. I set little max settings to um, having good speed, good toughness, good heart. But that's about it. So here we go, brother. Here we go. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, there we go. Where's the star? Where's the star for the crazy Africa? So we have to do, man. Let's be honest. We It's a game of cat and mouse here. It's a game of cat and mouse, and I just want to say, if we get KO'd in the first two rounds, um, I'm going to try one more time. Oh yeah, we got to get on our bike. This is like facing Isaac Frost. Oh, it's like facing Isaac Frost, man, let's be honest. Oh yeah, there's a nice little tight little uppercut by Mac. Mac's got to get on his bike. He definitely has to get on his bike. And what we got to do against Mike Tyson... Whoa. He's got um, crazy punches. Oh my! Oh, no, no, no! He's got crazy punches, but um, those looping shots—I <laughs> was gonna say, 
They're a lot easier to get out of the way compared to the shots that Muhammad Ali sends your way. But look at this. This is... <laughs> you know what's funny? <laughs> Little Mac, man. He's <laughs> so tiny. He only has a 64 reach. There! Nice little slap! See that little tight little hook right there? There, nice little uppercut. I'm telling you, the speed factor in Mac. <laughs> and I nicknamed him Tiger, like Eye of the Tiger. You know? Come on, he's, he's kind of like Balboa. But yeah, the speed factor in his feet. Ooh, see that? See how when Tyson does that? We can get out of it, brother. We can get out of it. It's quick. Tap him and run. Tap him and run. It kind of reminds me of, uh, I have an older brother, and I used to always tease him. <laughs> when we were in the kitchen. <laughs> Give him a shot to the gut and then go running upstairs. That's what we gotta do. Just a quick shot and bail. Quick shot and bail. Oh, nice head move, Mike Tyson. And again, Mike Tyson in this game is crazy good, obviously. But I juiced him up to a 98, which makes him just almost unstoppable. Oh, oh geez, good. Oh, come on, Mac. Mac, you gotta connect. There we go. Whoa. <laughs> this is so crazy, man. This is like I'm playing a horror movie or horror game, excuse me. Oh, come on, Mac. With the tiny little reach, we gotta, we gotta stay in that line of fire and hope we dodge it. Ooh. There we go. Ten seconds to go in this round. Oh, jeez, no steam on his punches at all, man. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was a fun round, man. That was a fun round. He's moving in with his head down. That's all right, man. They always say marathon, not a sprint. Our stamina is looking pretty good. Here we go. There. Oh. See, I took a chance going for a three-piece combo there, but that leaves you wide open. Here we go. Shots to the gut. Should we give him a groin shot, man? Huh? There. Shot to the jewels. See that? I don't think the referee saw it. <laughs> Just to let him know. Oh, that looked like he—that looked like he gave me a shot right back to the jewels. Did you see that? Come on, Mike. Oh, nice. Oh no! No! Come on, no, no, no. Oh, get on your bike. <laughs> Holy smokes. Oh, look at our health. Oh, my goodness. Okay, we really got to get bouncing out. Gotta hop, the, hop the ring, hop the ropes. <laughs> we really have to just kind of let Tyson gas a little bit. No, 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 no. Yeah, keep on, keep on throwing those shots, Mikey. Oh, jeez. <laughs> He's relentless, too, man. He's definitely relentless. Oh, look at that big uppercut. That looked like the uppercut from the Nintendo game. There we go. Again, Tyson's doing a nice job managing his stamina, I feel. Is he? Oh, there we go. Triple shots to the... Triple shots to the, to the ribs right there. Look at Tyson slowing the pace down. Oh, nice by Mackey. Oh, that was a nice little sequence right there by us. But again, no pop in the punches. Nice, there's a good one. Keep on working the body. Our stamina is not that bad. Jeez, I had to peek at the round. Sometimes when I get excited, 
don't know about you. You lose track of time. <laughs> you gotta be careful here. Oh, oh, come on! So the good news is, let's be positive, man. You know, the weekend's here. <laughs> the weekend's here, you gotta be positive, but... We didn't get dropped, man. We didn't get dropped. We got hurt. That was it. Oh, see Mac? Mac kind of sh shook his head there to begin the round. I'm listening to uh, Atlas. <laughs> I love it. Let's go, baby. Not focusing. What are you talking about? Oh yeah! Come on! What you got? Let's get him to whiff, man. Let's get him to whiff and counter. Oh, there we go, baby! Let's go! And there's another one. Even though we're pillow fighting here, those pillow shots will. Those pillow shots will have an effect on him. Hopefully in <laughs> the later rounds. <laughs> oh, holy cow. That was a Shryuken right there. Did you see that? Crazy, crazy juice on that Tyson uppercut. What I'm seeing right here, man. I'm seeing Tyson getting tired. Nice. There we go, getting a little tired. Doesn't seem like he's got that zip on those punches already in Mac. Every round that goes by, it's advantage us, man. Little Mac is showing that heart that we all love. <laughs> I'm just waiting for the stars to pop up above Tyson's head, man. Remember that? Slap on select. When you get the stars in NES uh, Tyson punch out, Mike Tyson's punch out, um, you would hit select and you would um, get a huge power uppercut and it would create a lot of damage if you landed. But if you get hit, you would lose a star. Right here, we're in, you know, I feel like we're out of those um, dangerous waters that Mike Tyson kind of brings you in in the beginning of the fight, right? Now we gotta just stick to boxing, brother. Stick to boxing and hope, <laughs> hope we don't get hit with anything. <laughs> Holy cow, can you tell I'm having way too much fun? I don't know why it's the weekend. I don't have to work. I don't have to work. Be with the family. Hang out, play games. Can't go wrong with that, but look at Mike. Looks like he just... He just left the buffet, man. Look at him. Absolutely exhausted. You ever feel like that? Jeez, when I would leave Mandarin back in the day... Holy cow, I wouldn't be able to walk out. <laughs> or Ponderosa. <laughs> Shoutouts to Ponderosa, man. That was my one of my favorite restaurants. You know, you would leave Ponderosa and you would walk out there. Kind of like you just gained 50 pounds. But look at this. Wait a minute. How was that a 10-8 round in the first round? Focus judging. Is uh, McQueen or <laughs> remember McQueen? From uh, the story mode, DL McQueen, is he paying off the judges here? What's going on? But I feel like, like I said, and I know I'm repeating myself and I apologize in advance, but I feel like every round that goes by, it's advantage us. There. You know? And he may, uh, you know, if, if we can exhaust him, he may go down just due to sheer exhaustion. And exhaustion's a word, by the way, right? <laughs> it's been a long day, man. But um, I don't know if you've I, you've heard this story, but you know, I uh, used to train boxing. I still do in my garage. Can you believe it? But I used to box with my father, and um, just for fun. And I remember feeling like getting, you know getting knocked out not because I was getting hit with big shots just because I was exhausted so hopefully oh my gosh hopefully Iron Mike that will, that will happen to Iron Mike the one thing we have to worry about though 
is uh, Mike has that one punch stopping power that I'm concerned about. It's in the back of my head. You don't want to get hit in this game with a big bomber Rooney. Because if you do, the referee doesn't even give you a chance to get up. He just says, call it a night. Let's all go to Ponderosa, baby. <laughs> but um, yeah, you got to be careful with that. Holy, look at, look at Mike's stamina, man. And I know you're probably saying to yourself, you're probably saying to your monitor, TV, phone, that Ricky Baby are not really hurting him. His health is high. But I know. But can he hurt us with stamina that low? Right? There we go. Shot to the gut. Again. And again, we have um, a really, really short reach, which is, you know, not good for me in my style. I really like to be on the outside throwing shots, but our reach is just not giving us that opportunity, right? Not giving us that uh, that range. Yeah, that's a better range. There we go. But look at Tyson. What happened? What happened to all that stamina, big boy? Uh-oh. Oh my gosh, who got hit with the... I don't know who got hit there. But look at him. He's content. He's content with just hanging out on the ropes. But drama is building here. <laughs> oh, I can't be. I'm lunging in there, man. The little Mac. It's feeling pretty good, and I and I feel like our corner is feeling like um, there's some faith here, man. The faith is brewing, but look at Ty Tyson got a stamina boost. Tyson got a stamina boost. This is not what I expected, by the way. I expected, I'll be honest with you, I'm no pro in this game. I've said it many times. I expected to get stopped in the third, maybe. Just because we're at a an 80 with no power, I feel like the heart of Mac is keeping us in the fight. There we go, baby. But I feel like my patience is um, keeping us in the fight as well. No Iron Mike, the seed of doubt. The seed of doubt is in that mind right there. Just because <laughs> he gave us the kitchen sink, man, the first couple of rounds. We took it, and now we're still standing in his face. And now look at this. The tables are turned, and we are stalking the great Mike Tyson. And the fans are, oh my gosh, the fans are feeling it too, huh? 70,000 plus. Oh, big. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Feeding of bombs. <laughs> Gotta watch out for my stamina though. There we go. I the tiger, man. I the tiger. Oh, jeez. And we're doing some damage now. Look at that health. There we go. Shot to the belly. Huh? <laughs> oh, man, this is too fun. Again, you just gotta touch him. That's been my strategy while while boxing, man. Just touch. You're not looking for that hero bomb, that home run bomb. That's not me. Oh, man. We're anticipating that big bomb, and then I want to counter with a just a straight, not a power straight. Let's see. Oh, jeez. There we go. Nice. There we go again. <laughs> Mikey, what are you gonna do, man? What are you gonna do in a couple rounds? What you gonna do, brother? Huh? Again, I can't get overconfident. Can't get over Connor. We gotta throw that jab. Throw that jab, baby. Pa 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 pa. Huh? Pa 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 pa. Pa pa 
pa, pa, pa. <laughs> oh. What a round. Good round, good round, good round. Good round, we gotta keep the positive vibes brewing here. But what I'm noticing is every round Tyson's getting a stamina gain here, you know, compared to how he was at the end of the round. Oh, okay, come on, baby. Oh, me. That was a mean hook right there. That was very mean. There we go. I gotta go to that body a little more. I know it's not the flashy shot. Not the flashy shot. There we go. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be mindful of my stamina though at this point of the fight. Mike's doing a good job though, I gotta say. Not throwing crazy shots. Being economical with his shots. This is turning into first a war, now it's turning into a chess match. Our head movement's still there, which is nice. Usually when your guy gets tired, the head movement goes. Oh, I just jinxed it, now my head movement's gone. See that? I can't move my head. There we go. Oh, jeez. This is. This is. This is a, a crucial round for me, just because my stamina. It's the stamina, man. Stamina game is affecting us at this point. Oh! <laughs> Look at him putting his whole body weight into his shots. There we go. Wow, look at our stamina, people. Now we're totally wearing it. No! No! Oh, man. That came out of nowhere. Don't do this. Not again. Okay, we gotta hang out here. I'm gonna get up at 8. Seven, eight. Okay, here we go. Oh, man. <laughs> we gotta retreat. Gotta just retreat. What happened? You know what? I totally jinxed it by um, being cocky to Tyson. Saying, what are you going to be like in a couple of rounds? And he just came out of nowhere. The crazy knockout. Okay, here's my strategy. My strategy, I'm going to let him just throw his shots early in this round. And then um, hopefully he kind of gets a little tired and then start throwing punches. I want to see the cards too. I want to see the cards. Where do we stand? Here we go. There we go. That's a nice shot by us. Huh? Pumping my own tires, toot my own horn. Yeah, but I think that's the best strategy at this point. Let him kind of throw his shots. And then I'm only going to counter when it's a big bomb. Or we have an opportunity to land a big shot. There. Same body shots. I don't want to. I don't want to throw unless he misses. Let me know if you agree with that. Let me know if you guys agree with that, man. There we go. A little jab. <laughs> he snuck that jab. That was hilarious. There we go. <laughs> this is not what I expected. <laughs> 
You know what I wasn't expect- I wasn't expecting our stamina to just leave us. Like, when did that happen? I gotta go back and check the tape after this. There we go. We gotta be so careful, because he's countering every time we throw a shot. See that? To the point now where I'm scared to, to, to engage just because we've tasted the canvas. And there's just nothing behind our punches. There we go. <laughs> there's a soft uppercut. You didn't even bug him. Didn't even bug him. Oh, there's that classic Mike Tyson head movement. I feel like we've um, lost this round, lost that last round. Who knows, man? Who knows what the judges are seeing, but I don't know if we're going to have enough gas in the tank to make it to the 12th round. I cannot wait to see the cards, man. Are they going to show it here? Oh, Tyson's up. See that? He's pulling away. Yeah, that's the championship part of Tyson. Oh, I keep on, keep on being just a little bit out of range. See, it seems like our head movement is back in a way. Because we have a little more stamina. So I'm going to try to use it. There we go. There we go again. Again, you're not feeling the zip. Oh no. No, 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 no! <laughs> little Matt goes down again. His rent's going to get dicey. Left too much. Hey, we got up. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, we're gonna go down on our shield here, man. This is it. Usually, when I start getting hurt like this, I just go into straight shots only mode, counter straight. Is all I'm gonna try to do, maybe. What do you think? Ninety seconds to go, halfway through round eight. Oh man, I just can't seem to get in there. So I'm trying to like just avoid those big bombs and counter, but there we go. There we go, Mac. Come on. We need more of that. There we go. That's it. Well, look low, ref. Come on. What are you looking at? We have to headbutt him. We gotta get dirty here. <laughs> there we go. Man, you don't want to stay in that pocket. I don't want to stay in that pocket for too long. It's a hook. Let's go. No. Oh, I thought we were going down right there. I thought we were going down, man. No, oh. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, Mike. Mike, don't do this to me. 34 years later, man. And you're sending me down. Oh, no. Boys to men. No! No! Ah, oh, man. 
34 years later, and we're still tasting the canvas. Just like I was at my buddy Paulo's house, man, back in the day. But I felt like we gave it a better effort. We had our moments, but what went wrong, man? What went wrong? This one stings big time, because I'll be honest with you. In the fourth round, I felt like we had the fight. I felt like we really did. And then something happened, man. I think I was just, I don't know, getting a little too excited and things fell apart. Yeah, it was after the fifth. See that? It was after the fifth and then the wheels fell off. But eh, that's just how it goes, man. That's just how it goes. But thank you so much for tuning in. Let me know if you want to see a rematch maybe in a month or so. But I'll lick my wounds and I'll be back. But... Oh, it's so crazy. I started off this video <laughs> with so much hype, so much happiness, but uh, I gotta say, I'm still happy, man. I'm still happy, but um, can't lie, man. This one stings, but it's all good. 98 Mike Tyson versus an 80 Little Mac, and we gave it a good effort. Just came up a little short, but thank you guys so much for tuning in. Let me know what other crazy matchups you want to see. And I'll showcase it here just for you guys. Love you guys, man. Have a great weekend. This is Ricky J. All the best, man. I'm out. Peace.